right, we're going to go over a lot of the insights that you can gain and little tricks that you can find in the Omnibar. It's a magical, magical thing. All right, so here's actually something I only knew. Oops, there's the zoom in and zoom out, which we went over earlier, so we turned it to default. But here's actually something I um, learned embarrassingly recently, which is that the little star at the very far right, that will bookmark that page, and it'll also allow you to edit or remove that, you know, you'll save it to a certain area. All right, now on the far, far left side, you'll see that little lock icon. Now that means that this site is secure because it's HTTPS and you can find some other information. We'll go into that in a second, but let's say let's go to an unsecure site. Now I happen to know that that CNN is. Okay, so now in this case, this is uh, just HTTP, not BPS. So um, it gets this little kind of folded paper icon instead of the lock. Now on this one, you'll see that this one has a lot of cookies because it's you know a big commercial site with a lot of graphics and things of that nature. Um, and you know it also tells you that this identity of, study of this website has not been verified. That doesn't mean that this is a fake site. It just means that um, it's uh, you know some of the background uh, identity stuff is is not exactly. It's it's fine. It just it, the more the less you know, probably the better. So okay, but in permissions, here's a kind of a cool little thing that you might want to try. Once again, this is something most people are not gonna want to do, but um, it's it's nice to know you you have the power. So you go into the individual cookies that are affecting this page, and as you know, that nearly all websites use the uh, cookie um, technology to track you or to, in theory, make the website run better on your computer. But it could also be used for um, you know annoying and bad stuff too. So here, you know, all the different kinds of cookies and things that are uh, in this particular website. So if we went to say metric CNN, there's all the cookies. Um, now I have no idea what this is. Um, yeah, I mean, I could not even tell you what that's like, but let's remove it. And now, uh, or I could even block it even, which means it would stop it from coming back. So um, as we showed earlier, you can remove all the cookies uh, that are on your site, uh, you know, or go through that history, which will help your web um, experience go better because the, the cookies can slow you down, or there can be some bad things um, hidden in there. In this case, um, I'm sure these are fine, but if you delete them, don't worry about it. They'll just come back next time you go into CNN or whatever website you're, you're going on. So that's just a good thing to know that you have the power to do. Um, so that is some magic hidden in the Omnibar. Have fun with that.